much like Sri Lanka, an example very similar to Sri Lanka, a man with no political background, a man nobody thought would come into politics even, came in and not only did he take over the Republican Party, he took over the entire country, the United States. Donald John Trump, who took over as president in 2017 in the US. Now, what is going on with him? You know his history, you know his story, but what you don't know is as of now, he is being charged with multiple felonies in multiple states across the continental US. First, being in the state of Washington, D.C., where he is charged with four criminal charges of attempting to overturn the results of his presidential election in 2020. And not only that, he is also charged with conspiracy to defraud the United States in other states, such as the state of Florida. Now, that is not only it. He's also being charged in the state of New York with 34 counts related to mishandling election campaign funds as well. And not just that, even in the state of Georgia, he is being charged currently with and they will likely indict him in this regard as well on criminal charges of attempting to overturn the result in Georgia of his presidential election. And not only that, he is being charged across four states. You know his story. And where will this lead? He is the first ever former president to be charged, bring to be brought criminal charges rather. And what will be his future? A man nobody expected to come into politics. He changed the way US politics is seen as of now with his very extravagant methods of speaking, very extravagant methods of controlling and leading the party and forming his own, in the sense, Republican-style party as well. What is the future for Donald J. Trump? Stay tuned to News First as we bring you the very latest.